What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today's video we're going to be solving two different flooded yards, mine and my neighbor. So let's jump right into it. All right, now as you can see here on my house, I'm eventually going to be putting pavers along this whole side all the way down to the sidewalk. So you want to make sure that this downspot's not trapped in here. And over here we have my neighbors. He's got his sump pump and his downspout. After I have pavers come here, all this would be trapped sitting in here, slowly trying to go down and nobody likes that at all. We do not want mosquitoes breeding within our yard. So I'm going to be tying his sump pump into his downspout, teeing them across, having everything go, and then go straight out this way because there's too much electrical boxes and everything over there. So let's get started. All right, here we go. We have it all dug out now. Everything is under the sidewalk. We have it going all the way. You got my house on the right. Got the cable line there. Irrigation, as you can see. Did call for markouts for both properties. So everything is nicely marked out. Missed all the irrigation lines right here. This is why I prefer to hand dig, so that way you don't have to break any bunch of the stuff. And now we're gonna hook all this up, hook the sump pump to that downspout. Have everything shoot across, come over here, tie into it, and go out to the street over there because once again, with all these cable boxes here, you can't really go straight to the street. So now I'm to pipe it all up. And here we go, we have it all completed. As you can see, even from the pump line itself, we have it downhill to level. And everything hits down here. Please, again, always make sure your glue when you're dealing with anything with pressure. We have the dance button here. We have the Y with the 45. Comes all the way down to here. Everything gets here. Still going downhill to level. We go across. My downspout tees into it. And you can see here, extremely downhill to level, all the way to the street. And as always, once you are hooking this up, make sure you drill a hole, two holes in the bottom of the 90. Take your rock, put rock all around it. Burrito wrap it before you backfill. Now, to backfill it all and show you how it works. And here we go. This is exactly how it's gonna work. All the water from the downspout on the house on the right, downspout on the house on the left, plus the sump pump. Everything is tied into each other. It goes there. As you can see, I put the grass back. Everything goes there, all the way out. To the street builds up overflows and goes towards the nearest storm drain that is exactly how you prevent water from flooding your yard by running your gutter downspouts out to the street another job well done by jersey shore drainage solutions as always like share comment subscribe and until the next one